Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. So, for today's video, we are going to be trying out two products. So, I recently got this Bello Tinted Sunscreen and this Quick Effects Tinted Moisturizer. And I just wanted to try these out on camera with you guys. I know that this has been all over the internet lately and that's why I decided to get it. And ito naman, nakita ko siya because of a sponsored post on Instagram. And I was just really curious about these two products that are tinted. Because honestly, I'm the type of person na kailangan ko talaga ng coverage as you guys can see. So, I'm a concealer type of girl. But I really wanted to try these products out. And that's what this video is going to be about. So, I'm going to try this tinted sunscreen on one side of my face and this tinted moisturizer on the other side of my face. And maybe we can compare these two. Let's see if one product will be better than the other. Or, you know, just see kung ano ba ang difference ng tinted sunscreen sa tinted moisturizer. And, yeah. So, let's get into the video. So, kailangan kong mag-headband. But honestly, wala akong mahanap na headband. So shades na lang muna. So, I'm going to try out this tinted sunscreen first and I will be putting it on the right side of my face but I don't know kung left side yan ng camera for you guys but basta dito sa side na to is the tinted sunscreen. For the tinted sunscreen and actually the tinted moisturizer I just bought the small versions because bago ko bilhin yung big versions, gusto ko muna makita kung ano ba yung maging effect niya on my skin especially for these two products kasi pareho silang walang shade range. They're both just one shade. For this Bello tinted sunscreen, it says that it has tone adapt technology Technology. So, supposedly, it's going to adapt to your skin color. So, let's see. I brought you this. Sabi mo, wala kang headband. Tamad ka lang kanina. Yeah. Ay, ayoko na. Tumatamad na ako. Kanan mo lang eh. Huh? Ang ganda naman ang hair mo. Danda. I need sura. Anyway, so this tinted sunscreen says that it is medium to deep. So hopefully, maka adapt siya sa akin because I really want to like this product. It's kind of a mousy consistency. And looking at it, parang medyo maputi siya. But let's see how it'll look like on my face. Ang parang ang puti. Papanoorin mo lang ako. Yeah. Nice. Okay, so I'm just going to blend it out with my fingers because I feel like ito yung type of... What the fuck? Anyway, sana hindi nag-iba yung lighting ko. So, I'm just going to blend it out with my fingers because I feel like this is the type of product na for people on the go. I'm just going to blend it out with my fingers. By the way, guys, it smells super good. It reminds me of like... A childhood powder. I don't know if that makes sense. It blends out pretty quickly naman, but my problem is parang medyo mapute. But wait, let me blend it out first. It's too much for me. Yeah. It's so white. Okay, so na blend out ko na siya. What I noticed is parang it's a little too white on me. I'm not sure if masyado maraming nilagay or not, but honestly, this is not my perfect shade. But I feel like if you set it with a darker powder, you can make it work. The difference of my face from my neck is not super drastic, but if kinompare mo yung side na to that has the tint, dito sa side na to na wala, you can see the difference na naglighten yung face ko here. It's not super bad, but it's not my perfect shade. That's all I can say. But on the bright side, I can see that it did kind of even out my skin tone on this side because sobrang hindi talaga pantay-pantay yung um, skin color ko on my face because of discoloration and pimple marks and stuff like that. It didn't completely cover all of my imperfections like my pimple marks and my veins but it did even out my skin tone it smells super good and the finish is not tacky at all i feel like kapag 
hindi ganun karami yung nilagay mo, you will definitely be able to make this work. If you have the same um, skin tone as me, I feel like I'm a medium morena skin tone. So, if you're darker, I'm not sure how this will work for you. So that's for the tinted sunscreen. Now let's try this tinted moisturizer by Quick FX. So this is just a moisturizer. Of course, the sunscreen has SPF. This is SPF 50. But I really wanted to try this tinted moisturizer and compare it to this tinted sunscreen because this tinted moisturizer is just like 60 pesos. Meanwhile, this tinted sunscreen, the small version, is like 175. This comes in a sachet. That's the only downside about this because I do not like sachets. So let's see kung ano yung consistency nitong tinted moisturizer. It has sort of the same consistency dun sa Bello tinted sunscreen. Okay, so it has the same moussey consistency but it's a little bit more watery. Wait lang. I want to see if they look like they're the same shade. They're almost the same shade, pero mas mapute ng onte tung tinted moisturizer, which I'm scared about because maputi na nga sa akin slight yung tinted sunscreen. Ano pa kaya tung moisturizer na to, but we'll see. Alright, so na blend out ko na yung tinted moisturizer. And one thing I noticed is because nga this tinted moisturizer is a little bit more watery compared to the tinted sunscreen, mas madali ko siyang na blend out. But the only thing is mas onte yung coverage niya. Wala naman din masyadong na cover yung Bello tinted sunscreen, but I feel like na even out niya yung skin tone ko. As opposed to this tinted moisturizer, I feel like it really is just a moisturizer. Hindi niya masyado na even out yung skin tone ko dito. And I'm not sure if it's showing up on camera, but in real life, I feel like it really didn't do much. As for the finish, um, once it dries down, it's kind of like the tinted sunscreen na you feel like you don't need to set it. And yung tinted moisturizer, wala siyang amoy. Unlike yung Bello tinted sunscreen, parang may cute powdery smell siya. But I feel like one of the good things about this tinted moisturizer is dahil nga super super light lang nung coverage niya, it was able to adapt to my skin tone. So I don't know if you guys can tell pero ang puti talaga nung face ko dito. But because nga this tinted moisturizer has super super light coverage, hindi niya masyadong pinaputi yung face ko. So all it did was kind of give like a super 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 light coverage and moisturize my face. I will uh, do my makeup off camera. Siguro just brows and a little bit of tint. Hi guys! So this is what my face looks like after I did my brows and a little bit of... A little bit of tint. So I played around with my Colored Color Tints. I'm currently wearing a mix of Piper and Coco. So I parang transition eyeshadow shade tung Piper and yung dark red is actually Coco. Wala ako nilagay sa cheeks ko. Usually I put Piper because I don't want to put anything on top of the tinted moisturizer and tinted sunscreen because I want to see the effect of these products on their own. Alam ko naman that these products are actually products that are supposed to be underneath your makeup so dapat manalagay pa ako ng concealer and stuff like that. But I feel like kapag naglagay ako ng concealer, hindi ko makikita yung full effect niya. Kasi kapag naglagay ako ng concealer, guys, as in para siyang foundation. So, mawawalan ng point yung pag-review kapag naglagay ako ng concealer on top. Anyway, so I will see you guys after a few hours. I'm probably going to edit a video and try to clean my room. And yeah, I'll see you guys in a few seconds actually kasi edit ko to. Hi guys! I am back. So it is now 10.40. I think I finished filming at around 3.30. So that's about seven hours. It is raining super hard right now. Kaya kung may narinig kayong sound, that's the rain. 
so let's just ignore it. So this is how my face looks like after 7 hours. It's super oily na, so I'm going to be blotting my face. Let's see which side produced more oil. But honestly, I'm a super oily person. I feel ko yung conclusion lang na makukuha natin dito is oily ka, Nicole. But let's still see what happens. So this is the oil on the Bello Tinted Sunscreen side. I'm going to blot on the other side. So this is the oil on the Tinted Moisturizer side and this is the oil on the Tinted Sunscreen side. Honestly guys, for me, medyo seam lang sila. Now I'm going to use a makeup wipe to remove the product. Para lang makita natin kung gaano karaming product ang natira after 7 hours. So this much product yung natira on the Bello Tinted Sunscreen side. And halos wala na talagang natirang product dun sa tinted moisturizer side. As for the final verdict, I will get back to you guys because I want to do my makeup first. Hi guys! I am back and I'm here to give you my final thoughts on these two products. Let's start with this Bella Tinted Sunscreen. So, I actually ended up really liking this product. I feel like masyadong marami lang yung nilagay ko kanina. If you put the right amount and if you set it with a darker powder, if masyado siyang maputi sa'yo, you can definitely make this product work. For me, it's a little bit too white and I'm a medium morena skin tone. But, one thing I noticed is after a couple of hours, siguro mga 1 to 2 hours, yung super white cast, Nya on me kind of faded. So after a while, it really does adapt to your skin tone. As for the amount of oil that it produced, I feel like parehas lang siya dun sa tinted moisturizer. So I don't really have problems with oil control because oily person talaga ako and I really do have to blot. I feel like it didn't cause me to oil up even more. And that's considering the fact na hindi nga ako nag set when I use this product, so that's really good. And lastly, I feel like tumagal naman siya on my face. Again, considering the fact that I didn't even set this product, that's really good. Kasi after 7 hours, may natira pa on my face. In terms of it being a tinted sunscreen, I actually really, really like this product. It's nice that it's a sunscreen that has SPF 50, so skincare na siya and makeup at the same time. It is pretty tinted because it evened out my skin tone, but of course, dahil tinted lang siya, wala siyang extreme coverage, so it wasn't able to completely cover my veins and my dark spots, but I actually really, really like this product. The packaging for this small version and even the big version is super cute, and it has a really really nice smell so in general i actually really really like this product for the tinted moisturizer i feel like it really does moisturize my face but for the tint i feel like it doesn't have enough of a coverage compared dito sa tinted sunscreen kasi i feel like hindi ito masyadong nakapag even out ng skin tone ko but the good thing about this is because super light ng coverage niya hindi problem na isa lang yung shade niya because naka-adapt talaga siya sa skin tone ko because nga ang light-light lang ng coverage. The packaging is pretty okay. Like I said, I'm not the biggest fan of sachets pero may takip naman siya so you can really take this with you on the go. In terms of oil control, I feel like same lang siya dun sa tinted sunscreen. It didn't cause me to oil up even more. But in terms of longevity, feeling ko hindi siya tumagal as long as this tinted sunscreen kasi nga nung tinanggal ko na siya with a makeup wipe, halos wala na talagang natira. But I feel like that's okay kasi nga tinted moisturizer to and it's a product na para i-prep yung skin mo for makeup. And again, I didn't set this product so kaya siguro hindi siya tumagal. So as a summary, I'm not the biggest fan of this product. I probably won't buy it anymore kapag naubos ko na to. But I feel like it is an okay alternative for this Bello Tinted Sunscreen if you can't get your hands on this. But between the two, I would definitely go for the Tinted Sunscreen because this definitely has more benefits compared to this Tinted Moisturizer. But again, I'm not saying that this Tinted Moisturizer is a bad product. Sinasabi ko lang na mas gusto ko talaga tong Tinted Sunscreen. And yeah! 
So that concludes this review. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope naging helpful to sa inyo kahit na medyo magulo yung review. But thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you have not done so yet. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! So this tinted sunscreen said that... <laughs> I don't know kung what... I don't know, pero para sa akin, it's kind of smells like... There's something wrong with me today. <laughs>